Hello, ladies and gentlemen. What's up? It's Maxi Mac Bali here. Um, here is my first tutorial on my new tutorial series. If you didn't ch get catch my um, announcement video telling you all about what I plan to do with this series, you might as well go check that out. But I forgot to add one thing: is that this little center point right here is not going to stay like this. This is just a quick little build up, so I can sort of give you an idea. Probably gonna have a nice fountain or something beautiful. And um, a base up top, like that, I can sort of showcase, um, showcase like snapshots and stuff. I like a little jump system up there. But let me get on with the tutorial. Now, as you know from the title, if you read, this is going to be all about command locks and giving you potion effects. And I mean, I think I'm pretty late on that snapshot because I just got back from holidays and like all these tests and stuff. But yeah, as you can see here, command lock effects. And that's really nice. That's really bad. Uh, sorry about that. Anyway, so you, as you probably know from the snapshot, you can add effects with uh, Google command box. That you know, same effects that potions can give you, and more actually. But uh, I've labeled them all out here, right on the wall. So here, poison, and you step on this, and you'll get it. Alright, so if you download this world, you can test it out for yourself. But I'm basically going to show you what you need to type in to get the effect of whatever one's on top. So let's just begin with the first one. So speed, if I step on it, I'll get the speed thing, and I've set it to speed 5, so I'll be going really fast, just for you know, showcase purposes. But, and it's going again. So if I step on it again, you can see it there, speed. And it doesn't have a number because it's, it's above the normal number that you get. So, now continue on to the tutorial. This is all you have to type in. You have to go slash effect at P, and at P, if you use command box before, means it's going to choose the closest player, which is me, because I'm standing on the pressure player, and I'm the only one here. But um, these three numbers are the important, like the key features of this effect command. The first number, whatever this is, this ranges from 1 to 20, because there's 20 effects. Um, 1 is speed, right? Up there, speed. First number is the effect, and this is number one. And number one is speed in the list of all the effects. Number five is the time. So if I change that to 10, I'd get it for 10 seconds, and 30, I get it for 30 seconds. And if you type it up to a million, it'll be infinite. You get two X's on, um, you get XX colon XX, and that means it's infinite, and it's never gonna die. It's never gonna run out until you die. Like, as soon as you die, you lose it. Um, and number five is the strength of the potion. So if I set that to number one, and step on it. You can see I have speed number two. And for some reason, if you add number one in, it gives you two. Actually, I wonder, wonder what happens if I put in zero. No, it didn't work. I didn't do anything. Uh, if I don't do anything, no, nah, still not. So as soon as you put one in, it'll always put the number above it. And most of these all max out at four on the number here, which is five on the effect. So if I put in four here, I'll get, oh, not even. If I put in three, maybe it maxes out three. Sorry about that. I'll let that, let that one out. Um, okay, there you go. Three and four. Like three equals four, and I think four is the max. But whatever number you put it at. So if I put this at five, just for, I'll just show you something. So if I put it at five, I'll be running like relatively fast. This is just walking as well, by the way. Um, okay, now it's gone. And if I change this to 10, and stand on it. As you can see, there's a whoa, way bigger difference. I'm sort of stepping out of pressure base here. This is good. What have I got? Hunger, fire, this is a <laughs> good reading. Alright, um, I'm just going to change this back down to fire so I don't forget. And slowness, you know, exact opposite. And so, if, I'm not going to go through and tell you all the numbers because it's pretty damn simple. I've, I've done it from left to right, all the way around the room. Um, one until 19 and yes, I did say that 20 because there are but I didn't you know have space in this room to build it and I didn't want to go through and build it all again. Number 20 is a wither effect um, It'll give you the same effect that the wither you know, boss does when it hits you in one of its skulls I'm not exactly sure what it does. It just sort of drains your health or whatever um, But let me just go through and show you all of the effects that potions can't do. So if I go through here slowness um, I'm pretty sure these two don't uh, aren't potion effects. So haste will when you step on it will make you um, hit faster. Like that's that's I'm tapping and then 
if it's gone, that's normal. Right? I'm just spamming as fast as I can on the mouse. And I stand on it. And then watch this. Right? So that goes way, 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 way faster. And then when that runs out, mining fatigue is the exact opposite of the thing. So you step on it. And it goes way slower. Right? And then it's gone. And wait. There you go. That's normal. Uh, strength, instant health, instant damage, jump boost. This is one that is in the effect. Jump boost is basically step on it, right? And you can jump however. I think it's. If I said. If I say five, I'm pretty sure I can jump six blocks high. But, you know, I haven't tested it and I don't plan to. But I'll leave that to you. You yeah, know, that's the fun of it, right? Oh, and also, by the way, in case you had noticed, I'm also using carpets, which are also a new feature in one of the latest snapshots, which are pretty cool. You can get them in all the different colors. But there are more. Um, nausea is another one that you can't get from potions. So you step on it and it will basically trip out your whole screen. And this thing, if you leave it on for too long, I swear you're just gonna you're just gonna pass out. All right, I only put it up to ten seconds, and if you put it on five seconds, it just sort of doesn't even work. But that's just a quick example. You can always change it. So if you want to change it, like I said before, just change that middle number to whatever however long you want it. This is in seconds, so it's on ten, so it's ten seconds. Um, regeneration, resistance. Fire resistance, water breathing. I'm not sure if those are potion effects. Can't remember off the top of my head, but pretty cool. Fire, is, oh, fire resistance is. I'm pretty sure, but water breathing. Is, so you know, you can breathe underwater if you have this. Pretty damn cool. Invisibility. Yep, you can have that. And um, blindness. This is another one. Uh, there's a couple more actually, but um, blindness. This is one that's really cool, and I think you could use in a really cool adventure map. Inside, as soon as you step on it, you basically like enclosed in a circle of blackness, and you can only see what's just there around you. And well, oh, next fire looks pretty cool. Wow. Yeah, that's pretty cool. And I'm sure for all you adventure map makers out there that watch my channel, will be able to use that to your advantage. Uh, what else is there? Hunger, weakness. Weakness is the opposite of strength, right there. And poison. And then there's wither, yeah, number 20. But yeah, 19. Uh, if you have any questions about this, please do not hesitate to comment. Um, and if you did like it and you watched this all the way to the end, I thank you so much, and um, be sure to subscribe to me for more on this massive build that I'm going to one day finish. Um, check the link in the description for the download, uh, I'll probably put it on my Dropbox. So yeah, thanks for watching, um, share this video so I can get more views, <laughs> that's a bit selfish, share if you want me to get more views and want me to like making more videos, and if you like my videos, just tell me, be like, dude, love your vids, sub for sub or whatever, you know, I'll do it. I'm just, I'm new to YouTube in a way, like I've had YouTube for ages, but I've only just sort of really started making videos. Alright, I'm blabbering on. I gotta stop this here. Thanks guys for watching, and I'll see you next time. Peace out.